Hi, this is Shadi. I believe the saying goes as follows. If it's black, fight back. If it's brown, lay down. And if it's white, good night. So this video is not about glorifying martial arts or to tell you that they work against wild animals. This video is going to be discussing two cases about two martial artists who did get lucky surviving attacks of unprovoked bears. So uh, two martial artists, actually, they were thankful for their training because if it wasn't for the training, they couldn't have fight it off. So this video is not about to show like some immense skills, but mostly the attitude. And we were lucky enough to have one case that was actually caught uh, on camera. And you're just going to see uh, the courage of the man fighting uh, the bear. So the first case is here. It's a climber that was uh, going up and he had a GoPro on his head and here you see the bear just lunges down at him and if you watch the full video you can find it online you will see that the climber was yelling very violently as he is fighting off the bear with hammer fists and also stomping down until the bear finally decides to run away the second one is a 63 year old fisherman who also practices uh, karate and he describes his uh, encounter with the bear so he tries to hug him and the bear threw him away so but from a short distance he starts to strike as he is showing you here but he did get bitten and uh, scratched so uh, luckily the man is still alive with very minimal injuries so this is good and the reason why i'm making this video is the not only the sheer luck that these two have had because if they were somewhere else or if it's a different kind of bear they would have been dead for example if they were in alaska and if it was a brown or a grizzly bear or worse a polar bear in another geographical region they wouldn't have survived at all so luckily for them uh, and in japan in general there is a lot of black bears and there is a lot of injuries that happen because of them and a lot of people do get hurt but here, these two incidences, uh, the men were uh, safe. And also another thing that I want to add is uh, randori or sparring, which is very good regardless of what martial art you do uh, practice. Uh, it does create this uh, fighting spirit in you, even if you don't have it maybe from past experiences that makes you scared of the idea of sparring or also uh, a character default whatever it may be but randori does give you that edge to really stand up and fight and uh, that's really important and i do believe that it did help them now again they were lucky enough to survive because martial arts are not for wild beasts so if you have something to add let me know down below this was shady and thank you for listening